say hi guys welcome back to my mom's channel We're doing our nighttime routine together. Every night is not the same, but try to stick to like a routine. And tonight we're gonna go to the dog park, probably go for a walk and maybe have a play date. We also have tubby time and dinner time. And yeah, that's if you're new here and you've never seen my face, hi, my name is Natalie. I have a one-year-old daughter, her name is Arabella, and we share our lives together. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and follow for more mommy daughter content because this is basically our channel now not just mine but yeah spend the night with us okay we need shoes on so let's get our shoes my goodness smells like poopy in here so we have to do your trash as well shoes and socks socks and shoes arabella come on Who's ready for the park? You ready? Yeah? Okay. Let's go. Arabella, can we leave Tiana here? We're gonna leave Tiana here, okay? kids that play on the lawn they're one and then um another little girl she's like a little older she's so they're both really really cute you ready and all the kids go on the lawn and they're like best friends so we love our little group so that's where we're going right now come on it's like arabella's favorite part of the day i swear go go it's the ball Just got done with our play date. We're gonna go for a little bit of a walk and then have dinner. But first, we're gonna go for like a mile walk, I think. Tank is in his cage and waiting for Arabella to hurry up. Let's go get her. Hey, you ready? Come on. Say bye bye, Tanky. I love you. We'll see you in a little bit. Bye bye, Tanky. Let's get in your stroller. Do you wanna face mommy or do you wanna face out? Good. Come on, Arn. Okay. Good? Hey. I got it. Where did you put your sippy cup? <laughs> Where is your sippy cup?
Now it's time for dinner. Arabella is beyond hungry, so let's start dinner. been obsessed with grapes so I just gave her some grapes and she's never had jello before so she, she's like touching it now hold on and I didn't know these took two hours to thaw so it looks like she's not having this tonight um I've never bought these before so this was a miss <laughs> Okay, dinner tonight, we have rotisserie chicken, <laughs> black beans, which are her favorite, grapes, and jello, which she is having so much fun playing. She's never had jello ever. And inside the jello, there's peaches. So I think she likes the jello best. I probably shouldn't have given her that yet. Um, I should have just let her eat and then kind of give it to her, but it's fine. We live and we learn, huh? How is it, good? Okay, I heated these up, but I'm, I don't think I'm gonna, oh my God, Arabella. I don't think I'm gonna give her these tonight because she's really in her food. So I'm just gonna put these in my little containers and then she'll probably either have this for lunch. I might pack her a lunchbox for my mom's house or she'll have this tomorrow for dinner. But it basically has broccoli, carrots, corn, and red peppers. I'll probably take out the red peppers though because I don't eat red peppers and she does not eat red peppers either. These I'm so sad about. They take two hours to thaw. These uncrustable ham and cheese. I've never bought them but I thought it'd be, cause she loves ham and cheeses. So I thought it'd be like a good little dinner, but did not know they take, they take two hours to thaw out. So I'm gonna have them tonight for dinner and see how they are. And then if they, if, she, if I like them, I'll, I know she'll like them. So we'll try them again tomorrow night. Normally when she's finishing up and she's not like she's starting to slow down a lot like she is right now um her bathroom's right here so I run her a quick bath I just turn it on and kind of just start it let's be tanky She's just playing with her food now, so I'm gonna do the laundry.
Who's ready for the tubby? Time for a tub. I'll get back to you when she's done. The nice thing about my apartment is they do valet living. That's Arabella right now. Which means that they come and pick up my trash so I don't have to bring it to like the dumpster or anything. So let's go bring my trash out in front of my door. Okay, she's eating these like little Encrustables. Even though you just had dinner, um, I did not like it and I wanted to see if she would like it and she does, she loves it. <laughs> she eats so much for a little girl. Also, these pajamas are from Target. Um, I have the matching set, but it's 8.13. She's supposed to be in bed right now, guys, but we kind of got home like a little bit later than normal and <laughs> she's just still eating but really she's always on a routine like she's always in bed by 8 or like 8 20 the latest um but tonight it's just kind of like a chill night do you want some more of the uncrustable baby this little girl eats so much food it's insane tubby's done we brushed our hair we did aquaphor and we also did cerave she had a dermatologist appointment today and that went really good. She got prescribed a cream. But I'm gonna be talking about like her face and everything in another video, probably my next video, I don't really know. Um, probably gonna be like a chit chat video of kind of what's going on. She's playing. So normally by this time when she has her bath, we brushed her teeth. We have not brushed her teeth yet, though, but we have to. Um, and we do her face routine or skincare. I like for her to play for like a little bit and then I make her bottle. So like I talked about in a previous video, we did get rid of our bottles. No more bottles. We are on sippy cups now. And she does not have formula. She has whole milk even though she's supposed to be on almond milk. I just, I need to use up this whole milk that I bought. So until this is run out, she's on this and then we'll switch. We FaceTime Sam every single night before she goes to bed. <laughs> Drink your papa. Okay, I just put Arabella to bed and it is nine o'clock right now. Took a little longer than it normally does. That was tank. I was holding her and I was crying because I feel like she's growing up way too fast. And I don't want to start crying now, but like, she's just getting to be like such a big girl. And like, I, I love her so much. And like, the fact that she's growing up, it's like, it's sad. <laughs> like, she didn't want her milk tonight. We don't do Baba anymore. She doesn't have her formula. So for the past two weeks, we've done this game called Eyes, Nose, and Mouth. And I ask her like, where's the mouth? Where's the nose? Where's your eyes? And she'll point to it. And normally she gets her eyes and her nose mixed up. Tonight we played the game and she got all of them right. Like I'm so proud of her, but like, I'm so sad she's like not like four months anymore. I'm so sad she's like, not like a freshly newborn. Does that make sense? And like I get that I'm like, I'm so happy she's learning and like growing as a person and becoming her own person and whatever. I'm so sad she's just not like a little baby baby anymore. And maybe it's just me, maybe I'm crazy. But 
it does it really really like gets me so sad i cry a lot over her but yeah i was just sitting there rocking her and like i literally could not put her down so that's fun but she's now in her crib she's sound asleep and it's time for my nightly routine now <laughs> when she goes to bed that's when my routine kind of starts let's jump in the shower put on pjs and then eat some dinner Okay, I just got out of the shower. My head is, my forehead is peeling so bad. Um, but I was going to skip dinner. Um, sometimes I eat dinner, sometimes I don't if I have like a really late lunch. I had Chick-fil-A for lunch, amazing, right? But when I was in the shower, I was thinking about mac and cheese. I do have mac and cheese, so we're gonna make mac and cheese. Woot woot. I just realized the pan I need to make mac and cheese is dirty. <gasps> so bad. I think I'm just gonna hand wash it and use it because I really want mac and cheese. video but I don't have another video to edit other than this one and I want to save this one until tomorrow to edit so I'm not going to start it now um because once I start editing I have to finish it like bothers me if I don't um and I'm not really in the mood to edit so I am probably gonna watch a show or some YouTube and wait until my mac and cheese is done buffalo chicken and this also is made as well and then it's pantry staples you can have confidence knowing right because i know a lot of people are in struggle with dairy. the weirdest thing just happened so if you guys watched my last video in disney i said i broke my camera camera which i did i literally broke my camera and i went to go fix it because i have like the little screw thing that i use to like fix it every single time it breaks I go to fix it. Tell me why this is like already fixed. My camera's already fixed. Like nothing's wrong with it. It's perfectly fine. Like what? How how did that get fixed? I didn't show you guys, but I used CeraVe on my forehead and in my face. I use this every single night, basically after I get out of the shower, just to moisturize my face. It's like the only moisturizer I really, really like. And now I'm going to use my peptide glazing fluid. Even though there's like a lot of drama with the whole Hailey Bieber, Selena Gomez, whatever, um, I still love this shit. And to me, it makes my face feel so good. But then again, I do love her, so. My forehead is so bad, oh my god. <sighs> also, my daughter literally abuses me. She scratches me everywhere. And we cut her nails, and she still manages to scratch me. So, she's a mean little girl, she is but I love her. I wore my hair extensions today and I've never had such a migraine in my life. Um, but I am getting my tape-ins back in, so I'm excited. Anyways, guys, that is it for today's video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and thank you guys so much for watching. Yeah, that was kind of our night routine. 
Like I said, not every night is like this, but this is kind of like the gist of it, I would say. I absolutely love this apartment. I love our little life we have right now. Every day is something different with a one-year-old, and I love it. I get really emotional because I cannot believe she's one, and I cannot believe that, like, she's becoming so much more independent, and it, it scares me, but, like, also, like, makes me so proud of her. Like, it's just the craziest feeling, and I feel like time is, like, going by so fast. And I literally cry, like, so much over it on how, like, time is going by fast, she's growing up, and, like... But anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys!